Hello, but this is me, Super Mario 19 Jane. Today, um, welcome to my first ever, um, my, my, well, actually, my newest series. Um, I think I might call this now the, um, World of Nintendo Hunt. Just for the fact that, oh no, I'm done with the Amiibos for now. Um, that really, they're starting to get really easy to find, so, you know, it's not really my problem. But not only that, but if I can't find them, my easy sort, um, the place that I would just go to is just Amazon and just get them for, like, whatever prices I really wouldn't care. Um, but yeah, but technically, um, as you know, but as the video starts, there is one, f um, figure that I did found, that I did find, but I did not, un um, unbox in this video. Um, that's because I found this, um, recently, and the video that you're about to watch, the two stores that I hit first, the two, the, the first two stores that I hit, um, I did that, um, pretty much two days ago. That was on a Friday, and today is Sunday, so I did go so I did go to Toys R Us, and I did find something. But I'm not gonna unbox in this video because, um, the end it's already gonna have an unboxing for the figure that I did find, um, not for the figure that I just found recently, but what I found, what I what I found on Friday, um. But yeah, this is pretty much my first level hunt. Um, in this video, I am I am actually going to two Walgreens to find the um exclusives, and I am going to Toys R Us, which I just did today, on Sunday. Um, but yeah, but I really do hope you guys enjoy this little hunt, the series that I'm about to start. And um, yeah, so pretty much enjoy this new series. Oh, alright guys, um, I am at my audience, I have found the 8-bit Donkey Kong, so I'm, I'm gonna keep him. Um, they have a Stroke Kid, another Stroke Kid, a Ganondorf, Shy Guy. Skull Kid, uh, Piranha Plant, and the Piranha Plant. But um, so far, they are well started with these Skull Kids. Um, I don't know if I should take one though. However, on us, they have a Luigi here. Um, I'm obviously gonna take the Donkey Kong one because you know, I've been looking for the 8 bits. Um, but yeah, but they have a pretty well start with these one Nintendo figures, but I'm obviously gonna take DK. Okay, so I am at another Walgreens, but, but look at that. I'm gonna have to put this one on. Let's see, on them all. Red Sickman. Oh, it's that. Hold on. Touch what? Luigi, Cranky Con. I see Link and Gandalf. Yeah, I mean like. You know, let me see this. They have a bunch of them, but not one of them is the eight bit exclusives. Now they do have this fire Luigi though. Well, this Walgreens has a bunch, but not the exclusives. So I'm gonna have to keep on hunting. So I guess I am at my larger Toys R Us. I have found one of the Series 2-1 Cat Toad. Um, there are also Fire Luigi, Doomba, Fire Luigi, Cat Mario, and a Bullet Bill. So far as for these, this one has Bad Paint Job, a Gold Mario, Gold Mario. But only three pillars of these and just a bunch of those. But anyways, I have found one of the Cat, one of the 2-1s. Um, I already have Cat Mario actually. Um, I don't have cat so this is actually pretty cool, and I also don't have bullet bill. But anyways, I'm gonna get this, and I'm gonna see you guys at the next store. Alright guys, um, if you, after that, um, little hunt, I was actually able to get, um, an 8-bit Donkey Kong, um, Water Nintendo figure. I'm actually very excited because I do have the 8-bit Mario Mario, 
but I don't have any of the 8-bit fidgets, so this is going to be, um, so I'm quite excited to actually, um, have DK in my hands. Um, to be honest, it's, it's, it's um, well, I live, it's very tough to find one of these 8-bits, um, especially because of the fact that I don't see them anywhere at all. I don't see them in Target, Toys R Us, um, Walmart, um, I can, I can possibly find the, um, 8-bit, the, um, 8-bit original Mario, but I, I might not be able to find, um, Luigi, po um, possibly, um, Link, but just because of the fact that since the, um, New Wave came out with him, there was, a, there was the um, other 8-bit Mario and the 8-bit Link, so I might have a chance of getting that, but not in its, or not in this fine package. Um, but yeah, um, anyways, I am actually gonna open this up, now of course if you saw in the Wild Wings video, um, the first one where I went to, um, there was, there was, um, a lot of store kid, um, you know, and a lot, and, um, some Ganondorf's, now I don't really know if Ganondorf is real or not, um, I just really don't see him at, um, at any store, so please comment down below, um, if he is real or not, cause if he is, then I can possibly go back there, um, possibly either, like, on, on the weekend or something, and I can actually be able to get Ganondorf before he's gone. Um, and also Store Kid, too, but just because of the fact that, um, I don't see him anywhere. I mean, I mean, usually, like, whenever it comes down to these, um, 2.5-inch figures, I don't really see them that much. I don't really see them often. Um, the only ones I do see are the common ones, not, like, um, Ganondorf, Store Kid. But, yeah, but it, in the second one, of course, you guys saw there was a bunch of, um, the 2.5-inch there was Red Pikmin, Armand, there was a whole bunch of common characters, Cranky Con, um, there was a Ganondorf, a Ganondorf too. Um, so I'm actually kind of excited that some Walgreens that are past my area um, have a great amount of stock for these 2.5 inch. Now of course, um, let's, let's already dive into this um, toy here. Now of course, as I said, in the front we have the 8-bit um, Donkey Con right here, and of course he is at the top too. Also with the World of Nintendo logo here. On the back, we do have his little description. I'm gonna try to focus this on. Wait, no, that's not. I can even focus on this. That's such. There's one I actually it was actually able to focus, but for some reason it's not on here. But of course, yeah, on the bottom we do have the listing. Of course, there's Store Kid. Oh, and there was also Piranha Plant too. Um, Dizzy Con, Shy Guy. Um, the all the Ape Class more, the Ape Star Power more, Lu um, Luigi, Donkey Kong, and the White Tuna Link. Or just Ape It White Link. That's what they call it on here. But of course, I am still on the hunt for um these two exclusives. And so, yeah, so I'm gonna I, I'm I'm actually getting pretty close. You know, I did find a set. I did find one of these sets where I did have the listing of it. And, um, um, but, yeah, but this is technically another 8-bit fiddle, and I, I'm actually gonna try to open this with, with nice packaging still. There we go, this is getting, I just And this is pretty, this is tough packaging, like, really, like, to take off. Like, I'm, it, this is getting, like, really tough. And it's possible because of the, um, the bottom part, too, it has a bit of paper. 
So whenever I do cut it, it's not going to be like, oh, it's going to be 100% phew. It's going to be like, you know, I'm going to have to put some power into cutting this. I wish I had a bot total, I wish I had a bot total or something so it can be a lot easier, um, to I've been having, I've been using this ever since Amiibos have coming out, um, and it, it's, it's getting, it's getting a little bit pretty tough to do with, with, um, paper now. And of course, I did get them open, I don't know if I can smell the plastic, like, seriously, like, if I can see Pit 2 Vision do this, then I can probably do it, but I have no idea why. Um, but I mean, but Tanner Cash has said, um, <laughs> I can't spend the packaging, I really can't. Um, but yeah, but Tanner um, I've taken it out of its package. So here he is, Donkey Kong is right here. He's actually, oh, please. Oh, ah, he put a little bit of power into that one. But yeah, the packaging is nice and clean, as I said. Um, I don't really, um, usually whenever it comes to packages like these, you know, I like to keep them. I don't know about the other ones that I have, because, you know, they're technically all ripped. Like, the other versions of, it's like, so far I have the Fire Mario, Ice Luigi, and Waluigi packages of this, but I think I might just throw those away, because I ripped through that. And this one is actually not, you know, I kind of like the packaging of this, and also the fact that there's the 8-bit characters back, um, back there. And up here, not only that, but it also tells you that, on um, what the character is, and also the title down below. Now, just, I know the hunt may be very short, but as the, um, as the video goes on, um, I am gonna be tra I am gonna be going to different places. Especially the fact that I am moving. I am actually gonna move in summer, so I'm going to, I'm gonna go back to Texas. And that is actually where there's a lot of places too. There's like a lot of Walgreens, Walmart, um, Targets, Best Buys, Toys R Us. So that'll be fun, you know. At least hunting will be a little bit, will be, it will get a little bit more fun. Um, but not only that, but it will get a little bit more exciting too. And of course, um, we have DK here. We have 8 bit Donkey Kong. And um, of course, uh, he, is, he is in this post, he's exactly like the. 8-bit Mario Mario one where there's no back to it. But hey, but it's also in, like in a 3D um, dimension form. Where you'll be able to see like what is behind, like hand of, hi, what is behind him, what, what's on the side. Actually, I wouldn't really say behind because of the fact that it's, that there's this on the back of it. Um, but yeah, this is just a simple figure, no articulation, but it is a very good um, detailed 8-bit figure, you know. We hardly get any 8-bit figures now these days, matter of fact, um, you know, nobody really cares about the, um, 8-bit characters from back then. If you actually look at it, all they care about is, like, new stuff coming out, like music, TV shows and all that. So we hardly even get any 8-bit characters. Um, I, I actually hope they do more of these. Um, people are saying get the Smash Brothers ones from Super Mario Maker. Um, all right, guys, um, my can't, the, um, it, it stopped, it, oh, why am I even close to the camera? No, that's not even how it's supposed to go. Um, it turns out it stopped recording, but anyways, uh, as I was saying, um, we don't really get any of the 8-bit fiddles, um, any 8-bit stuff, really. Um, but yeah, and I was uh, saying, um, people actually did want a Smash Brothers, um, line, but it would be the one from Super Mario Maker. Now, I wouldn't know how that would really work, but who knows? But yeah, but Tanaki, as I said, it's just another um, 8-bit character. It's the same thing as the 8-bit um, model Mario, but instead it's just um, the different characters. But it's actually very cool how you get to be able to see, like, the 3D effects, like, what is in front, what is behind. Like, his mouth, as you can see, like, the jaw is, is all covered with bricks, while the mouth is just an obvious... Um, it's like, beneath... What is, um, that I can't even, I don't even know how to say this. But anyways, um, you get the point, like, it's that, um, everything that's, like, all detailed is behind, while everything is popping out in the front. 
And so yeah, so that is pretty much technically it for this hunt. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Um, but not only that, but I think I might be doing more hunts like these. Uh, let me actually get something real quick. Oh. So I can at least push this back. There we go, that's actually much better. Let's bring this up a little bit. Um, but yeah, I, I, know this, I know this hunt isn't really a launch hunt, and I get that, but as I said, as the, um, the more footage that comes out, the more videos that will be popping out. And since I really don't know what to call this um, series, I guess I'll just call this the World of Nintendo hunt. Um, but yeah, but I, I think this might be a new series that I'm going to be creating that's going to be replacing the hunt, the search for Amiibo with the, the, um, the hunt for War, the, the World of Nintendo hunt. Actually, no, I think I might replace the name. I think I might switch Amiibos with World of Nintendo, the search for World of Nintendo toys. Um, I don't know, I have to think about the name, um, but for now, I'll just call this um, the, World of, the World of Nintendo hunt. Um, but yeah, but I only found DK, but... It really doesn't matter to me as long as I have one of the eight bit characters. I am I am alright with it. And um, but yeah, I have two eight bit characters down and a bunch of more to go. Um, anyways, guys, as I said, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next hunt or the next video.